Welcome to Chicken Soup for the Soul Hallway Heroes, a literacy-based anti-bullying program. We are excited that you have chosen to use this program to help lead the effort to prevent bullying, build students' ability to be positive influences on others and the world around them, and teach students important interpersonal skills. This orientation will give you an overview of the program to help you teach the lessons in this module. For more than 20 years, educators have used these books in classrooms to encourage reading, offer advice and support, and provide a resource for students. Now, the publisher of the best-selling Chicken Soup for the Soul book series has joined forces with one of the nation's most respected philanthropists and a team of educational experts to design a literacy-based bullying prevention and social and emotional development curriculum. This program aims not only to create heroes in school hallways, but also in classrooms, on playgrounds, in homes, online, and in our communities. I'm Alex Kajitani. I was honored to be the California Teacher of the Year, as well as one of four finalists for National Teacher of the Year. My students and the public know me best as the Rappin' Mathematician. I earned that title when I was trying to find a way to bring math to life for my middle school inner city students. I wanted to make math fun and engaging, and I was willing to do anything to get through to them. Yep, that's me. That's why I was so excited when Chicken Soup for the Soul asked me to facilitate this training. Because, like rapping, stories help bring important concepts to life. Through a joint initiative, Chicken Soup for the Soul and the Banyuk Foundation have published a series of books for children, teens, and adults to promote the vision of the foundation universal tolerance, acceptance, respect, kindness, and compassion. Supported by a television program, Chicken Soup for the Soul's Hidden Heroes, social media and online campaigns, and online resource portals, this curriculum has been developed to create a robust educational program for children, parents, and teachers so that the themes of the curriculum are discussed both in school and at home. I'm going to walk you through an overview to help you incorporate this program easily, simply, and powerfully into your classroom. Skill Development First, let's look at the skills that Chicken Soup for the Soul Hallway Heroes help students develop. Then, we'll explore how each of the program components addresses these skills. Bullying is a problem we all agree no child should have to deal with. Bullying prevents students from achieving academic success by affecting their physical, interpersonal, and mental well-being. Students targeted by bullying behaviors experience a higher risk of depression and anxiety, as well as sleep difficulties, behavioral disruptions in school, and health challenges like headaches and stomach aches. In many studies, cyberbullying experiences have been linked to low self-esteem, suicidal thoughts, anger, frustration, and other emotional or psychological problems. You might be surprised to hear that students who exhibit bullying behaviors toward others are also at risk for substance abuse, academic problems, and other violent behaviors. Chicken Soup for the Soul Hallway Heroes was developed to address growing concerns related to bullying and cyberbullying by giving students opportunities to develop their literacy skills while building the social and emotional skills of tolerance, respect, compassion, kindness, confidence, and empathy. Real Life Narratives, the core of Chicken Soup for the Soul Hallway Heroes, are ideal vehicles for students to practice literacy skills while learning how to address bullying and cyberbullying situations, create positive relationships, and develop a healthy understanding of themselves and others. These real-life narratives teach students to explore and value multiple, diverse perspectives and to develop empathy and compassion. The stories used in Chicken Soup for the Soul Create Your Best Future the book at the core of the middle school program 
are personal narratives that are based on real life experiences. The authors, who include both young people and adults, share their joy, pain, sadness, hope, and wisdom by telling stories of challenges faced, obstacles overcome, and lessons learned. By using real life stories in each lesson, Chicken Soup for the Soul Hallway Heroes connect students to the themes and topics of the program in deeper, more powerful ways than fictional narratives might. Each grade level module consists of 12 lessons. These lessons teach students to understand their own feelings and the feelings of others, to employ effective strategies to resolve personal problems, to learn strategies to prevent bullying and cyberbullying behaviors, to engage in safe online behaviors, to address bullying and cyberbullying behaviors in appropriate ways, to support their peers in challenges they may face in person and online, and to work as a team to produce a meaningful product. The Chicken Soup for the Soul Hallway Heroes program equips students with the social and emotional skills needed to respond to bullying situations both in person and online. In each lesson of the modules for grades 6 through 8, the topic of cyberbullying is specifically addressed through the use of scenarios. Students consider the interactions they have with others online, create strategies to make online communities safe and respectful, and reflect on the positive qualities they can demonstrate online. Students analyze real-life applications of cyberbullying and develop ways to address negative or aggressive online behavior. Students respond to real-life online scenarios and role-play solutions to challenging situations. In addition to reflecting on their own online habits and online citizenship, students are also prompted to consider their responsibility to other users. By engaging students in the authentic development of strategies, students assume ownership of the problems of bullying in their school and community. Enhancing social and emotional learning skills, such as empathy and the management of emotions, will contribute to a healthier school climate and ultimately reduce incidents of bullying. Safe environment. Now, let's think about how you can create a safe learning environment in your classroom in order to implement this program. The Chicken Soup for the Soul Hallway Heroes program challenges students to think deeply about how they can be a positive influence on others and the world around them. Throughout the program, you'll ask students to take risks in front of their peers, talk about their feelings and emotions, discuss challenges they've faced in their lives, and support each other in ways they may not be used to. It won't always be easy for students to discuss some of the topics in the lessons, and you will need to take this into account when implementing the program. Therefore, in addition to this orientation video, our online interactive training available for purchase and teacher guide discuss in detail how you can create the right environment to help students be successful with the Chicken Soup for the Soul Hallway Heroes objectives, as well as how to handle difficult situations that might arise. To address these considerations, this program features ways for you to Set the tone by establishing clear expectations for behavior with collaborative input from students, defining the expectations clearly, committing to these behaviors, and applying these expectations consistently. Create a safe environment that encourages trust, teamwork, and safety. Make appropriate modifications for students to whom sensitive topics may apply. For example, some stories in Chicken Soup for the Soul, Create Your Best Future, journal prompts, or lesson activities may contain sensitive topics that directly affect students for any number of reasons. Students may have personal experiences with a topic like bullying, homelessness, or a physical disability. You should make the appropriate modifications for students to whom a sensitive topic may apply. Be mindful of reporting obligations related to suspected abuse or serious safety issues based on federal, state, and local laws and district policies. 
In Chicken Soup for the Soul Hallway Heroes, students work with you and each other to develop strong social and emotional skills that help them manage their emotions and behaviors. This work helps students make real-time and appropriate decisions in challenging social situations. While peer-to-peer -peer interaction is important, student-teacher interactions are emphasized as well. In order to cultivate safe places and relationships, you must make a concerted effort to set the tone for all classroom interactions. As teachers, we all strive to create a safe, positive, and nurturing environment in our classrooms. Chicken Soup for the Soul Hallway Heroes provides many resources, including classroom activities, to help ensure that a safe, risk-free environment is created and maintained. So, how do you create a safe environment? Let's go over some key elements that you may already be familiar with. Establish clear expectations for behavior with collaborative input from students. Students need to feel vested in classroom rules and expectations. Giving students the opportunity to collaboratively establish the expectations helps to ensure buy-in from them. Define expectations clearly. It is important that students clearly and thoroughly understand the nuances of each expectation. Students should collaboratively identify what each expectation would look and sound like. Commit to these behaviors and give students opportunities to practice them. Students should be able to practice new behaviors just like they practice new skills in math. For added value and impact, it is important to encourage buy-in from multiple stakeholders, including administrators, teachers, students, parents, legal guardians, and other key players. In addition, each of these stakeholders can make a pledge to serve as role models or hallway heroes by demonstrating the desired appropriate behaviors. Enforce these expectations consistently. It is important for students to understand that values such as kindness, empathy, acceptance, and compassion are non-negotiable in the classroom. In order to ensure that students are truly free to express themselves and take risks, as is required when discussing sensitive topics, expectations must be consistently enforced. Throughout this program, students will read several real-life narratives that contain sensitive subject matter. The lesson activities and collaborative discussions will require students to examine these topics. To that end, you may identify places where you will have to modify components of the lessons to acknowledge potential sensitivities and to best meet the needs of your students. Some possible areas of sensitivity include emotional vulnerabilities, physical limitations, socioeconomic situations, prior life experiences, home life situations or family circumstances. Instructional design. Now, I know firsthand how you as a teacher are faced with countless demands meeting the diverse needs of many students, planning for instruction, delivering a rigorous instructional program, resolving conflicts, analyzing data, monitoring and assessing student learning, and often serving as counselor, nurse, caregiver, advisor, and a host of other roles within one given school day. With that understanding, Chicken Soup for the Soul Hallway Heroes program was developed so that it will be easy and flexible for you to implement. Let's look at the instructional design components together. Chicken Soup for the Soul Hallway Heroes was developed using a modified version of the highly successful 5E learning cycle and instructional model. We use the 7E model to ensure that students draw from prior experience and to give ample opportunities for students to practice the transfer of knowledge and apply their learning to real-world scenarios. It is especially important when teaching social and emotional skills for students to practice new learning in multiple contexts using simulations and real-world scenarios. The 7E model used in this curriculum ensures each lesson integrates project-based learning, literacy instruction, social and emotional instruction, and bullying and cyberbullying connections. The 7E model uses the following instructional elements. 
elicit, engage, explore, explain, elaborate, evaluate, and extend. The instructional design section of your teacher guide explains how the Chicken Soup for the Soul Hallway Heroes lesson plans are designed in more detail. Another critical component of the Chicken Soup for the Soul Hallway Heroes Middle School program is project-based learning. This component helps students build academic skills as well as elaborate on their social and emotional skills by providing opportunities for them to work with others on a meaningful, real-world project. Project-based learning is integrated throughout the lesson plan framework and module structure. It is a widely recognized approach and framework for student-centered, inquiry-based learning. In each lesson, students work together to build knowledge and skills through extended investigation of a question or problem. Over the course of the 12 lessons in the module, students will conduct research, use group decision-making, and collaborate in teams to make sure every idea is heard and every contribution to the project is meaningful. In sixth grade, students will identify the goals, challenges, obstacles, and accomplishments of significant people in history. In seventh grade, students undertake a project to spread kindness. And in eighth grade, students investigate the question, how can we address teenagers' concerns about bullying and cyberbullying? Next, the development of literacy skills is an essential part of Chicken Soup for the Soul Hallway Heroes. Students practice their literacy skills while learning social and emotional skills that bring positive outcomes at school and in their relationships. By reading, analyzing, discussing, and responding to the real-life stories in Chicken Soup for the Soul, Create Your Best Future, students apply the lessons to their lives, appreciate diverse perspectives and backgrounds, and develop empathy and compassion toward others. Furthermore, each lesson combines literacy objectives with social and emotional objectives to address both sets of skills simultaneously. Chicken Soup for the Soul Hallway Heroes integrates many common literacy strategies that have been proven to support student literacy growth. These real-life stories used in the program allow students to read with a purpose, leading to higher levels of engagement. As the teacher, you introduce the skills, objectives, and activities of each lesson by telling the class that they will read a story about a character who is facing a particular challenge. You ask students to pay attention as they read to learn about how the character changes and develops over time. Throughout the lesson, you will prompt students with questions and activities that ask them to respond to the narrative and to use textual evidence to support their views. At its core, Chicken Soup for the Soul Hallway Heroes relies on a student-centered approach to build the skills necessary to create positive environments and to address bullying and cyberbullying behaviors. Students take responsibility for their own learning, construct knowledge connected to prior experience, and learn in a positive environment with rich personal relationships and interactions. This is not a teacher-directed program. In fact, you'll be serving as a facilitator of learning by activating and building prior knowledge, prompting students to investigate and analyze a topic or concept, and guiding students as they generate questions and explore answers. Don't worry about needing to have all the answers. Your job is to guide students through a process of constructive learning. Throughout the steps in the lesson plan, Students respond to the prompts in the student journal. The journals are an integral part of the instructional lesson plans. The student journal provides an opportunity for students to reflect on the chicken soup for the soul, create your best future, real life stories and lesson activities, as well as a way for you to track student progress. Additionally, the student journals provide many opportunities to explore the program's concepts through writing prompts that incorporate reader response to the stories as well as personal reflections. Each middle school lesson also features a cyberbullying section where students engage in discussions and activities designed to bring awareness to cyberbullying behaviors and appropriate ways to respond to such behaviors. In these lessons, students discuss reasons and motivations behind bullying behaviors, such as differences based on race, 
religion, personalities, physical abilities, intellectual abilities, physical appearances, or interests and hobbies. Students are introduced to the disinhibition effect, a phenomenon where people do and say things in a situation they normally wouldn't. Students explore the implications that the disinhibition effect has on cyberbullying. When using technology, people believe they are invisible and do not get tangible or physical feedback, so their cyberbullying actions may be especially cruel and continuous. It is often difficult for the aggressor to understand the full impact on the target of his or her cyberbullying actions without this type of feedback. Students are also given opportunities to apply knowledge to new domains, specifically to realistic cyberbullying scenarios. In addition to a pre- and post-assessment to establish baseline information and summative learning, there are recommendations for formative assessments throughout the program, including class participation and collaborative discussions, journal entries, and other anecdotal measures. As part of the program, you receive a class set of the book, Chicken Soup for the Soul, Create Your Best Future. This book contains the 12 stories used in your grade module and many others that can be used for at-home reading or additional in-class projects and extra credit activities. The use of this entire book has been made possible by a subsidy from the Bonyuk Foundation. Implementation. So, you might be wondering, how will these 12 lessons fit into the curriculum that I already have to teach? Look, I get it. I've been a teacher for many years, and I can tell you, this is not a one-size-fits-all curriculum. These lessons have been designed with you in mind, providing a great deal of flexibility. As this program has a strong literacy focus, the lessons can be included in a reading or language arts block. The lessons are designed for 30 to 50 minute time periods, allowing you to limit or extend the duration of the lessons as you see fit. Since the curriculum was developed with a flexible, interdisciplinary design, it can be easily integrated with social studies, health, and other content areas. The curriculum can also be taught in an advisory or homeroom period, or even in an after-school program. You may decide to modify the lesson activities to allow for more or less instructional time based on the requirements of your daily schedule. Take as long as you need to teach each module. You may deliver one lesson per day, one per week, or just one or two lessons per month. Please select the option that works best in your classroom. The program is based on the power of storytelling, using stories from the book, Chicken Soup for the Soul, Create Your Best Future. These stories have been leveled using the Flesh Kincaid readability formula. These levels are provided in the scope and sequence in the teacher guide. Although the lessons primarily instruct students to read the stories independently, you may use your discretion to offer other reading options for students. Based on the readability level and the reading levels of students, you can decide whether you want to read the stories to the students, have students read the stories aloud, have students read in pairs, or have students read them independently. The sixth grade scope and sequence is provided here as an example. As you can see, the scope and sequence table lists the literacy alignment and the social and emotional learning skill objectives for each lesson. This is a useful planning guide for you to see how the skills are scaffolded and to pace your instruction. As demonstrated in the scope and sequence and lesson plan objectives, the developers of Chicken Soup for the Soul Hallway Heroes have kept content standards in mind as they created this curriculum you have received online access through the educator portal to a resource identifying state standards that are aligned to each lesson in Chicken Soup for the Soul Hallway Heroes. This table illustrates sample standards alignment for Grade 6, Lesson 4. In general, lessons are aligned to literacy, social studies, visual arts, health, and or physical education standards. Some states have specific social and emotional learning standards to which lessons are aligned. In each standards alignment document, there will be a key to indicate what each code stands for. For example, for the state of Nevada, the W code indicates a language arts writing standard. 
you can access the educator portal at chickensoup.com forward slash hallway heroes for more information. Educator portal. Chicken Soup for the Soul has also created an online portal for educators, families, and students to extend the reach of the program and share it with a much larger audience. The portal features a gallery of videos, featured real life stories, and ideas for teachers, administrators, students, and parents to extend the learning in the modules. As a teacher, you can share examples of student work, browse videos, download electronic versions of state standard alignments, and connect with others who are using this program. You may share art projects, group performances, posters, or other examples of activities in student learning on social media. It is especially valuable for instructors to see the results of student learning from other classrooms. Plus, teachers who submit may be selected to be showcased on TV or on social media. Please note that you should follow the policies of your school and district regarding the posting of student work online. To share or to follow Chicken Soup for the Soul Hallway Heroes, go to chickensoup.com forward slash hallway heroes. From time to time, there may be specific opportunities to submit stories for upcoming titles or even to feature teachers and their students on one of Chicken Soup for the Soul's television productions. Please connect with us online for more information. As we mentioned earlier, this curriculum has been developed with a number of other resources to create a robust set of tools and materials that bring the themes of the curriculum to teachers, parents, and children everywhere, both in school and at home. In addition to using Chicken Soup for the Soul Create Your Best Future as the basis for Chicken Soup for the Soul Hallway Heroes, the book also inspired many of the scenarios in the segments of the Chicken Soup for the Soul program on CBS's dream team, its epic Chicken Soup for the Soul's Hidden Heroes. These segments, and even those not drawn from the book, can be used as additional tools to reinforce the lessons of this program. Segments can be found on broadcast television, on YouTube, and on our website. Also available to teachers is access to a subsidized subscription to the Chicken Soup for the Soul online story library, made possible by a subsidy from the Banyuk Foundation. With a subscription, you have access to over 20,000 Chicken Soup for the Soul stories to read with your students, create additional projects and activities, and build your students' literacy and social and emotional skills. Chicken Soup for the Soul and the Banyuk Foundation have partnered to create two additional books that aim to achieve the same goals with kids, preteens, parents, and grandparents. Chicken Soup for the Soul, Be the Best You Can Be, helps kids and preteens discuss with each other and the adults in their lives the lessons learned from stories about embracing differences, rejecting stereotypes, and making good choices. Some of your students or student siblings may be interested in reading stories from this book. In addition, some of your parents may be interested in reading Chicken Soup for the Soul, Raising Great Kids, stories of parents and grandparents learning how to raise children in an environment of tolerance, respect, compassion, and kindness. These stories provide practical, insightful tips for parents, grandparents, and guardians to strengthen their families. We hope you will have fun exploring and using this program with your students, knowing that your efforts will have a positive impact not only on them, but on their families and communities. Thank you for playing an integral role in our mission to have Chicken Soup for the Soul Hallway Heroes help to promote tolerance, compassion, kindness, and respect. Please share your experiences with us at chickensoup.com forward slash hallway heroes. We look forward to hearing from you. As you're teaching Chicken Soup for the Soul Hallway Heroes, if you have any questions, please visit the Educator Portal or contact us at education at chickensoupforthesoul.com. On behalf of Chicken Soup for the Soul and the Bonyuk Foundation, again, thank you.